did she have to say? I know she was running her mouth. What did she say? Well, we didn't talk about you. Really? Really, Kenny. <sighs> what happened? It's over. But AJ needs us now. We gotta stick together on this thing, all right? Come on. Let's see if the truck's gonna go. Well, I'm guessing it's frozen stiff. <sighs> Midnight. <laughs> My daddy always had a half dozen wrecks he was fixing up. He was a mean son of a bitch. But he taught me respect. A girl like Jane. Could learn a thing or two about that. I like her. Just give her some time. Maybe you're right. Hell, I didn't know what to make of Lee at first. Of course, he helped me in mine more times than I can remember. Jane helped us back on the road. All right, give it a turn. So close, Clem. With a little bit of luck, I can get this thing running, and then we can get out on the road and really make some distance. Um, uh, yeah. What about getting it? has got to be out there. To keep running. Now, those rumors can't all be bunk. I mean, hell, there's got to be something out here other than snow and goddamn Euro trash. What about Mexico? Why? You want a taco? <laughs> I've never yeah. been there. I went once, a long time ago, just before I met Kath. All right, turn it again. Did you turn it? Yes. God damn it! Calm down. <sighs> Kenny, are you okay? We gotta get moving if we're gonna keep AJ alive. We're running out of time. I gotta get this thing to start. Gonna try warming up the battery. Go on inside. I don't like leaving him with that girl. The mic's in there as well. being a pretty little girl no one ever expects you to do a damn thing <laughs> this whole game has been me you doing and I stuff both know you had a chance to save Luke you and I both know what happened back there I got nothing more to say to you you can have your ugly jacket back Arvo wouldn't shut up, so I moved him in here. God damn it! I've seen that look before. Son of a bitch! Oh, shit. I've seen it too. A few times. Then you know what's about to happen. What? I know Kenny's a nice guy, Clem. I bet Carver was a nice guy too. Once. 
Probably have a nice job, a nice pretty wife. Then all this happened. And one day he caved some kid's face in and realized he could sleep at night. Kenny isn't Carver. He just made a mistake. All I'm saying is, start thinking about what happens if you're wrong. You two have known each other a long time. Sooner or later, they're gonna have to decide how much that's worth. I think it needs food or something. Yeah. What have we got? That chair. Yeah. Baby hasn't been fed or anything. Seems like you've done that before. You want to try? No way. It's gonna puke. Clem, no. No, I'm. I'm just holding my arms out for it. Hold it like this. Hey, hi. <laughs> my name's Jane. I think it's gonna puke. It's not gonna puke. <laughs> it's gonna puke. <laughs> it pukes. Back puke. It puke. <laughs> Gross. You only puke when it got wind, and they haven't been winded. There's not much left. I was running with some people a long time ago, down near DC. Some guy got trapped in the middle of a crosswalk. Can't remember his name. He used to call me Mary Jane. <clears throat> He's a douchebag. Anyway, the dick got stuck under a car, hiding from a dozen walkers. One after another, they went down there trying to save him. Lost four people before we got him out. All that for one person? That's what I'm saying. Didn't find out till later he was already bit. Turned and ripped the neck right out of this old lady. <laughs> the look on her face well, was after one guy could have died, six sky, people did. Like she was watching a bird. Look, Clem. Hey, we have a car. He got it working. Don't leave her with the baby. Who's watching the so baby? What's the plan? How much food do we have? At least a week. And for the baby? We need to find a place for the baby. Yeah, a place warm. I agree. We should head back south. What? We're kind of freeze to death. I don't know whose stupid idea it was to march up here in the first place, but it was a bad one. She's right. What if we went back to house? Wait, what? Fuck that. I was thinking more like Texas. Texas? The fuck? It was just an idea. We already talked about this. I'm sorry, we did? We're going to find Wellington. Right, Clem? Wellington? Kenny, it's freezing up here. We don't have to leave right now. Let's just sleep on it. Well, that sounds sensible. Damn it, we don't have time. Says you. Look, I don't give two shits about what you people think. I got this truck working, so I say where we go. And we're heading fucking north. It's the best chance we got to help an AJ. What about Arbo? Who? Oh, <laughs> he? Yeah, Ow. he ain't coming with us. I just hit my headset. You're just gonna leave him here? I don't give a good goddamn where he goes. He's done. He's too dangerous to bring. At this point, you might be right. He knows the area. He can help us. Oh, yeah, somehow he's in. He got Luke killed. I ain't gonna say he helped the situation, but maybe if you eased up on him before, he wouldn't have run away in the first place. Think about that, Kenny. Either way, I'm not going anywhere in the middle of the night. Yeah, me neither. There could be a herd out there. You want that child's blood on your hands, Mike? We're all gonna die out here if you don't calm the fuck down, Kenny. Haven't we been through enough for one day? Jesus fucking Christ. Remember the last time we had a working car and sat around on our asses, Clem? I'm going inside. At the very least, we know they'll freeze. In the heat, they might not even rock God that quick. God damn it! Kenny, don't listen to them. 
Fuck you, Bonnie. You better talk some sense into him. For his sake. Yeah, I have it for Bonnie. <laughs> She's the Ben of this game. God damn it! That stupid fucking. Get the fuck out of here! It's me. Clem. Sorry, just give me a second. Oh, is it eye seeping? Close the door. Can you believe this, Clem? I bring them a working truck, and they act like I just shit in their cereal. I knew Jane would have a stick up her ass, but I thought at least Mike would have more sense. He's turned out to be a real disappointment. They're scared of you, Kenny. Well, if their big plan is to wander around in the woods, they ought to be scared of more than me. Did you hear me? We're all scared. Look, we got maybe a day's worth of food for that kid left. That's it. Right, so I'm wondering to think find about Rebecca place. and Alvin. Oh, I mean, so. What if Lee hadn't gone tearing across half of Georgia looking for you? A lot of folks died to make that happen. A lot of folks died to get us this far. We owe it to them to see this done. Maybe he shouldn't have. Don't you say that. I ought to slap you. Go off for it. You know what he sacrificed for you? What I did? That means something, damn it. <sighs> Lee was here. <laughs> What'd you think he'd say? I think he'd tell me to try to keep the group together. Yeah. And that we should stay away from cities. We can't just give up on this kid. I mean, what's the point of going on after that? That's what people like Lee knew. And what people like Jane won't ever understand. Look, I know Wellington might be bullshit, but where there's smoke, there's fire. Krista heard about it too, right? You know, when I first saw you back at that lodge, I thought I was dreaming. And when you sat down next to me and we shared that meal, well, I could tell that you were different now, grown up. I, I felt pride. A pride I hadn't felt in a long time. But I need you now, Clem. There have to be folks doing better than us. Yeah, but we can't do it alone. We need the others. And that's why I gotta be able to count on you, Clem. We gotta convince them. You and me. Look, we'll figure everything out in the morning. Come on, let's get some sleep. So we gotta be ready. I hope the car starts it barded. Thanks for the follow, Mary Ball. If I said your name right. Is that Bonnie in? Who's there? Avo. Easy. Easy now. Step back. Clem. Shit. What are you doing? I got the rest of it. Oh, Clem. you motherfuckers. 
just leaving. Now keep it down, all right? Nobody else has to get involved. That's everything we have. Listen, we just gotta get away from that guy club, okay? Who? Kenny? Where's the baby? And Jane? Damn it, just, we don't have time for this. Come on, Mike. Let's just go. Oh, she's... Oh, fuck you, Bonnie. Fuck you. If I get to pick one person, I'm going to shoot it, sir. All right, Clem. Now, you come... walk up to you nice and slow. Go ahead. You cunt. No. You mother fucker. Jesus. Oh, uh, I'm going to kill you, Bonnie. I am going to carve you a new face. You know? Don't tell me that's the end.